Hey, Psych2Goers, and welcome back to our channel. As the famous saying goes, the eyes are the windows to the soul. Someone's eyes can hold a lot of emotion in them. In fact, it's been proven that your pupils will dilate when you look at someone you're attracted to. Of course, it's not just attraction. Eyes can be incredibly expressive and revealing. If you wanna see what your eyes say about you, take this short 10 question quiz to find out. First, grab a pen and paper or some way of recording your answers. Choose which statement fits you the most and write it down. At the end of this video, we'll tell you the results. Let's begin. Number one, do you keep your true self hidden from people? A, not always, but only when I have to. B, only my deepest secrets. C, yes, people don't need to worry about me. D, yes, I don't talk to anyone about it. Or E, no, I'm an open book. Number two, how do you feel right now? A, I feel terribly lost. B, I feel annoyed at everything. C, I'm feeling extremely depressed. D, I'm alert and cautious. Or E, I feel happy. Number three, how does your heart feel emotionally? A, betrayed, cracked. B, I feel hatred for someone. C, I feel shattered and down. D, I feel cold and emotionless. Or E, happy, fulfilled, ready to take on the world. Number four, what's your wish right now? A, I wish I knew how to answer that. B, I wish for vengeance for the people that hurt me. C, I wish I loved myself more. D, I just want someone to talk to, anyone. Or E, I wish everyone's problems would go away. Number five, are you good at concealing your true emotions from others? A, not at all. B, sometimes. C, it depends. D, yes. E, I wish I was, but nope. Number six, when do you cry? A, when I'm stressed and have no sense of control. B, when my emotions want to burst out. C, when I bottle everything in and can't hold it anymore. D, when I have no one to talk to. Or E, I don't find the need to cry. Number seven, how do you spend your time? A, in a state of constant worry. B, keeping my mind busy. C, hiding my real emotions or thoughts. D, alone all the time. Or E, getting out and enjoying life. Number eight, do you sleep well at night? A, I barely sleep. B, no, I only sleep around five to six hours. C, yes, I get about eight hours in. D, I sleep for way too long. Or E, I sleep great and wake up refreshed. Number nine, what do you dream about? A, nightmares and scary things. B, bawling, being chased. C, sad, distressing events. D, I don't remember my dreams. Or E, happy dreams usually. Number 10, how do you feel when someone is mad at you? A, embarrassed. B, furious. C, I get sad for hours and can't function right. D, sorry and in a constant state of guilt for days. Or E, sad, but not for too long. Okay, are you ready for your results? Tally everything and find the letter that appears the most. Found your most frequent letter? Here's what each of them means. If you got mostly A's, your eyes hold fear and doubt. Your eyes are hiding an uneasy degree of fear and doubt about many things. You feel a total lack of control over your life. Your turbulent emotions rule over you. If you answered B the most, your eyes are filled with anger and rage. Did someone do something that hurt you? You have a lot of anger inside you and it's welling up inside and waiting to burst. Or maybe you already manifested it in your actions, whether you recognize it or not. You can keep your anger under control at times, but there are days when you just feel like lashing out to the world and all its unfairness. If you answered mostly C's, your eyes hold sadness. You have more than a few reasons for your bouts of sadness, but you tend to keep it all under wraps. Maybe you're trying to seem strong, even when you're at your breaking point every day. Or maybe you're protecting something important to you and by sacrificing yourself and bottling your emotions, you make everything seem fine and happy on the surface. 
If you continue to bottle everything inside, eventually it will overflow and explode. If you answered mostly D, your eyes feel a sense of loneliness. You feel lonely and misunderstood, even with a group of people. You tend to feel that you're not your true self around them, constantly wearing a mask. You want to be genuine with someone, anyone, but you feel that there's no one that you can confide in. People may be led to believe that you're an independent person who enjoys your solitude, but you're just trying to blend in for people to like you. In the past, people may have failed you on multiple occasions. Learn to open yourself up to others. Not that perfect self you show with your mask, but your true, genuine, flawed self. You'll have more genuine relationships in the long run with people who actually care about you. It won't be easy, but it'll be worth it in the end. And if you answered mostly ease, your eyes glow. You're one happy person. You know you're not perfect, but you're happy and fulfilled at where you are now. You glow when you're with people and you're someone's light in the darkness. So what did you get? If your results were accurate, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and share this video if you had fun taking the quiz. The studies and references used are listed in the description below. Make sure to hit the subscribe button for more Psych2Go videos and thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.